Is it? He never works out. Um, <laughs> hi. Hello, how are you? I know Andy, but... Um, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's horrible. What is so... Is that camera you have from 1982 or? Um... Uh, it's 89. Yeah. <laughs> it's over 90, but. Um, it's gonna like explode or anything? Spark? A little bit. I mean, I mean, there's a time run, so I'm sure at some point it will. Everybody else has like iPhones and stuff. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I don't do technology. Really. Okay. <laughs> uh, so what can you tease about? <laughs> what can you tease about your first episode that you directed this season? Sure. Hold on. Can you say that again? So can you, what can you tease about the first episode you're doing? <laughs> tease? Yeah. I mean, or you can spoil the whole thing. I mean, I don't mind. Okay. Well, a bunch of stuff's going to happen with a bunch of people. And then, it, and then, and then it's over. Can you f confirm the existence <laughs> of maybe sand, a desert, or sandstorm? Huh. Interesting question. No. Um, <laughs> Um, what uh, what I can tease is is that uh, as we left off in the in the finale, which you you saw, Oliver um, admitted to the world that uh, he is in fact a Green Arrow, um, and I had him. Um, I wanted him to look right into the camera. It's not something we usually do, break the fourth wall. Um, and I had uh, Stephen look right into the camera, and he's like, "I'm not used to that. Oh, this is weird." And uh, but I wanted him to actually be addressing the world. So um, so we did that, and I think that came off very well. But now the world knows that he's the Green Arrow. So what you'll see is a lot of having to deal with that, um, and uh, the dynamics in that prison depending on how long we stay in, in that prison or how long he stays in the prison, are very, very different from um, the Oliver and the dynamic that you've seen on the rest of the show previously. So it's a new element to the show that way, and it's something that, like I said, you haven't seen before, and you're gonna find really interesting. Like, for instance, what, what would happen if Batman into prison and for instance in the cell next to him the Joker was just chilling you know making hamburgers or what have you the possibilities are endless so we're sort of trying to take advantage of all those situations that could and would probably arise within that sort of mythology we're saying that um, someone next in the cell next to him is going to be a do not very quote me face? do not quote me uh, exactly now maybe not in the cell right next to him maybe not I don't know I'm just saying <laughs> the possibilities are are endless in that respect so you uh, I think you'll find that he will be running into some familiar faces um, that I can't spill out here without somebody shooting me in the head. Oh, hey. Speaking of being shot in the head. <laughs> <laughs> what can you tease about the, uh, what the rest of the team is up to? Um, the rest of the team will be um, dealing with their lives um, with uh, Oliver absent and uh, you know not having a team leader uh, per se um, and what the consequences of not only uh, what what's happened when he's admitted to the world that yes I am you know the green arrow but the consequences that's had on the rest of the team because they've all been outed as well so you'll 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 see how you know the rest of the world sort of has to handle that and how they go on with their lives you know accordingly and or not go on with their lives, um, what have you. Um, it's a pretty, it's a pretty dark space uh, uh, without all the queen um, around in his original position. I think you'll find. But we're uh, we're taking it, we're taking the show to new levels of uh, sort of grit um, right off the bat in the premiere and. Uh, some things will happen that you'll be like, holy shit, I can't believe they did that. So, <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys.